Thanks. Uh, I really loved having the closed circuit TV rebroadcasting. Oh, good. Uh, so that was very helpful with not feeling like I missed out on a specific event. Uh huh. Um, I was wondering, can more of the performances be put on the closed circuit TV, or could there be a schedule somewhere so I could see those in a specific thing? Those are two things we tried to work on this year. Uh, staff bandwidth wise, we could not get beyond a certain point uh, of, of which venues we could record in for different events. And also there's only so many hours in the day on that channel. Uh, and the, uh, having a, a, a schedule published somewhere of what was being broadcast when was another thing we were hoping to make happen this year. It didn't quite make it onto the list of things that actually got executed, but it's absolutely already something we're planning on for 2018. It was one of the things that we threw at the wall. We didn't know if anyone would use it or like it, but just from this, you know, unscientific sampling, it seems like it was. So that tells us, okay, we'll we'll go to the next step. With and there, there are uh, the the Queen's Lounge, for example, does have uh, camera. Yeah, you've seen anybody seen the morning show? Greg Benson's the extra morning show. <laughs> they do have the ability to broadcast from there as well. Um, when we go beyond that, it turns into more of a staffing issue that we have to bring a camera and someone taking care of filming things like in the crow's nest, for example. Uh, but it is something, uh, it's very much in our planning as we reorganize and we look towards 2018 to have that a little better uh, organized and scheduled.